Hello, thank you so much for coming back and joining me for this week's Gourmet on a Budget. So today I'll be um, showing you this amazing eggplant parmigiana recipe. It looks absolutely stunning. So yeah, if you'd like to see what you need and how to make it and all that, then please keep on watching. Just so you know, I do upload a daily video on budget lifestyle. So it could be a budget recipe, skincare, makeup, um, a little shopping haul. It just really depends on the day of the week. So make sure that you subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell, make sure it's turned on to all so that way you are notified and just so you know as well I also do um, live streams every Sunday night at 9 30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time so yeah let's get into this really delicious eggplant parmigiana recipe so what you're gonna need for this uh, eggplant parmigiana is some eggplants flour Italian style cheese um, onion I'm gonna be adding a half a pound of sausage um, tomato sauce, um, some oil, and some Italian seasoning. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to start prepping my eggplant. Um, I got these, um, I got these little, uh, this, these little bags of them for a dollar, so I've never had eggplant, I don't think. So, okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and cut off the tops and the bottoms. I'm going to go ahead and get these sliced. I'm going to do them sliced thin. So that way, that way they all cook evenly. So now I'm going to liberally salt these and they're going to sit for an hour. That's going to help draw the water out, which will make it so our um, eggplant parmesan is not going to be soggy. So it's been about an hour. I just rinsed my um, eggplant and I'm letting it kind of dry a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and start getting my pasta sauce ready, my marinara sauce, whatever. So I'm doing a half a pound of um, hot sausage. I'm just going to go ahead and get that all browned up. And I'm going to go ahead and do half an onion. Okay, so I just went ahead and added my onions to my sausage so that way they can get nice and browned. And I added about four tablespoons of oil to this frying pan and I'm just going to turn it on medium low, let that heat up a little bit. Well, here are my eggplant pieces and I'm just getting a paper towel and I'm just taking off any excess water. And my looks like some of the eggplant was a little old, but you know what? That is totally okay. Um, we throw away a lot of food that is still completely edible. so. Taking off any excess water. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is I just have some flour, okay? I'm just gonna grab an eggplant piece and I'm just gently going to put it in the flour and make sure I shake off any excess. I'm gonna put it right in the oil. You wanna do this quickly because you don't want you really don't want the eggplant to like start absorbing like the flour because then it can get mushy. But just put it in the oil. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and open up my roasted garlic parmesan 
uh, marinara sauce. Just add it to the meat and onions. Just give it a good stir and then I'm going to cover it. Okay, so I have a plate here with paper towel, and I'm just going to go ahead and transfer the eggplant so that way it ex excess oil can drain off. I'm just going to keep on doing this. Okay, so I have my sauce here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put down a little bit of sauce down in the bottom of my pan. My oven is preheating to 350. You want to put a little bit of sauce down first so that way the uh, eggplant doesn't stick. So this is traditionally a meatless dish, but you can definitely go more traditional and don't do any meat. Um, but we want it to do with a little bit of sausage. I thought it would be good. Okay, so there we go. Okay, so here is my eggplant. So now I'm just going to start laying this down. I'm going to go ahead and just put on some cheese, and we're just going to keep layering it like this. So this is a blend of uh, mozzarella, provolone, romano, parmesan, and fontano, and asiago. Nice layer of cheese. Now we're just going to start layering again. We're going to do some more cheese. I'm going to go ahead and do a little bit of Italian seasoning right on top. And do my final layer.
So I'm gonna go ahead and pop this in the oven for 20 minutes covered, and then I'm gonna uncover it and let it cook for another 20 minutes. So I went ahead and just took this out a little bit ago, and I'm going to go ahead and start dishing up. It looks beautiful. Looks, yeah, it just looks so good. I hope you enjoyed this week's Gourmet on a Budget with this really delicious looking um, eggplant parmigiana. It looks amazing and uh, there was a lot of work to it and it, I do have a lot of dishes to do, but it looks like it was totally worth it. So anyway, thank you so much for coming back and watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and share this video. Not only does it sh help get these awesome recipes out there, but it also shows me that you're enjoying my content, which I would appreciate. Leave a comment down below. Um, do you like eggplant parmesan? Um, yeah, I've never had it, so I'm excited. Um, and don't forget, you're always welcome to follow me on my other social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all a budget glam, babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. I should have another video that should start autoplaying here in just a second. Or you can always click on one of the ones that's popping up around the screen. So yeah, I'll see you here in just a sec.